going to be showing you guys how to make these amazing, delicious, scrumptious, savory, juicy, tasteful, amazing. Did I say amazing? Did I say delicious? I probably, I probably did. But these cauliflower wings are so amazing. I can't get over it. If you have missed wings in any way, shape, or form, these cauliflower wings are going to be a huge hit. So let's go ahead and get to it. Alright guys, so for this recipe you're going to need one head of cauliflower. I've already cut mine up and thrown it into a bowl. You're also going to need two cups of flour. You can use any flour of your choice. Then I also used a couple different seasonings and I'll have the exact amounts down below with the names and all the good stuff. Then you're also going to need about a fourth, a cup and a fourth uh, of water and you're going to go ahead and mix all of your seasoning with your flour together. And the sazon that's thrown in there, which is a seasoning, it's a Spanish seasoning, that's going to make your mix turn like a, that nice orangey color once you start adding the water. So you're going to go ahead and add the water. And like I said, it's about a cup and a fourth, but it's all about like consistency. You want it to be not too runny, not really runny at all, but like kind of thick, kind of like a pancake batter. Because you want it to coat your cauliflower is really nice and kind of stick on there instead of falling, sliding right off. And Mia is trying to get a taste. You see, she's trying to get her little finger in there. And push her out the way. Mia, get your tongue out of the video. <laughs> she's so silly. And she keeps, she keeps going in. But yeah, so you just mix, mix, mix. And then once you get that nice consistency, you're going to pour in your cauliflower and mix it all together until it's all nicely coated. I prefer to mix with a little spatula or a little um, wooden spoon first because even though you can mix this with your hands, I always prefer to put my hands in food as, as little as possible. Not because I, want, I don't want to make the food dirty or my hands are dirty. It's just because I don't like feeling food on my hands when I'm cooking it for some reason. It just feels weird to me. But anyways, mix it up. Hey Mia. And then this is the part that some of you are going to be like, what? Yeah, I'm going to deep fry them. I don't deep fry things often, but you can always bake them. But that is what makes them taste so amazing. So if you're willing to deep fry, go ahead. And if not, you can all always bake them and they'll still be delicious. I do occasionally bake them instead of fry them and I don't do this this often. Alright guys, so that is that. Let me know what you guys think down below and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Also give this video a big old thumbs up because I would highly, highly appreciate it and I will talk to you guys very soon. Bye!